What's up, Amazon survivors? This is KG48, and welcome back to my Let's Play for Green Hell. All right, guys, there is like a million and one things I want to do in this game, but I think in the interest of me not being around for this update the first time around, I'm going to do something that I haven't done yet. Now, let me bring you up to speed. I have not been around for the building update, and I have not been around for the cultivation, plant cultivation update. Is that what it was called? Right? Where you can actually make uh, plots and grow your own plants. Now, I really want to do some building, but we are not quite in the, um, you know, we're not quite ready to do any big building yet. Uh, you know, plus I got to get some mud going. Um, I went ahead and picked up some mud. Let me show you really quick how you start on the mud building. Because some of you guys might not, well, you probably mostly know this, but just in case. Um, this right here will have nothing in it. Right? So what you have to do is you have to find a water source. Now, there's a couple things you can do with the water source. You can take some water, you can wash yourself, or you can take mud. So we're going to come down here and we are going to just right click and all you have to do is take mud. I'm not going to do it because it's going to make me dirty. But once you pick up the mud, you could just drop it, drop it back down and then you will get all of these um, mud thingy-mabobs that you can, you can create. Pretty freaking sweet. Um, I, that's probably what we're going to be doing next episode because I really want to start building. With this episode, we are going to do plant cultivation. It's pretty interesting, man. Um, you could pretty much grow a lot of different things. So that is going to be freaking sweet. Um, this is where the mud's gonna go, so I'm gonna do the plant cultivation over here. Let's get rid of this stuff. By the way, if you want to get rid of trees, you can cut them down, right? And what you do is you leave the game and then come back and then the stump will be gone. So that was great. There was a tree right here. I cut it down, left the game, came back, and this stump was gone. It was wonderful. Um, I also caught a peccary or whatever the hell I, it was. Let's take a look. Yep, peccary. So I do some peccary meat. We've got about 12 hours. So we got to do that today. Um, but first things first, I'm going to take this banana and I'm going to harvest it for banana seeds. All right? Because that would be ever so sweet. <laughs> Literally. All right. So let's take a look in our book here. Now, is there any reason to make small plants, plant crops? There must be a reason, right? First of all, I don't know where I got them from. Um, I don't remember seeing them in the game anywhere. You're supposed to have to find these. Okay, you are supposed to, I read it, you were supposed to have to find the blueprints for these things. Okay, the problem is I have not found any blueprints for these things and I just had them. Or maybe I did and I didn't notice among my travels. So, it could be the case. Now, you can only make certain things in certain plots. Um, they look to be about the same um, dimensions. Oh yeah, that's a, that's a little one. Okay, we're going to make the big one. And we'll, actually, you know what, we'll just make one of each. Why not? We'll make the big one first though. Okay, can we rotate? Uh, right click. Yep, there we go. Not that it really matters. It's kind of the same. Uh, oh, look at that. Huh. I wonder if you can actually make it off the ground or something. That'd be neat. All right, so... Thinking, like, right about there would be good. Looks good to me. And I'm going to put another... Uh, should I put a big one next to it or a small one? I think I'm going to save that area for a, sm for a uh, big one. That way we could have two big ones right next to each other. And maybe I'll put the small ones right across here. As far as I know, you can't destroy these bamboo sh structures right here. So they're kind of... I'm just stuck with them, right? As far as I can tell. Um, I haven't tried in this Let's Play. But last time I lived here, I did try and you couldn't do it. So I'm just going to... I'm going to assume you can't. But I don't really know for sure. Alright, so we're going to need some big old logs for this bad boy. We're going to need some sticks. There we go. A couple more logs. That would be wonderful. Man, if I could grow bamboo, that would be so sweet. But first things first, we need to worry about... Um, can I chop this down? No. First things first, we have to worry about um, food. Food and drink. Our number one concern. So that's what we're going to do. Alright, so let's come over here. Let's chop this one down. This should give me some big logs. God, this game is so freaking good. It really is good. It's it's the third best. I, I, I got to get back to Empyreon, and I will at some point. But I gotta be honest, I don't see how it's gonna beat this game. Like, I don't know, I guess it depends on what you're into. If you're into sci-fi, you know, you like flying ships around. Okay, yeah, I could see that, but I don't know, man. This um, this game really... Look at that. Look at that. Alright, so I need to put some seeds in there. Now, will the seeds die if I don't water it enough? I don't know, but it's raining right now, so let's just put them in there and find out. There you go. Now, oh, there you go, look at that. Now, uh, fertilizer is not mandatory, and there's all different kinds of fertilizers we'll look into. Yeah, you can only plant one in each one. All right, fair enough. Well, let's build the uh, let's build the small one and see what we can put in here. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, pick up this dry leaf, and then I'm gonna grab something to drink. 
Uh, stats are probably... Oh, boy. Okay. You know what? We got to start the fire. We got to start the fire. I'm going to go ahead and eat that. And we're going to go ahead and start this fire. And we're going to cook up some of that, um, some of that wonderful, delicious peccary meat. Hell yeah, we are. Yeah, this is so cool, man. Like, with the building and the, 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 the ability to farm. Could you imagine if, if we could, like, domesticate animals? Like, animal husbandry? I mean, forget it. At that point, forget it. Like, this game would just be, like, off the rails at that point. Just so freaking cool. All right, so we're just gonna keep an eye on that. I don't know what I don't know if that'll die. That's the only thing I'm wondering. Will it die if it runs out of water? That's the only thing I'm wondering about. All right, well let's go ahead and put some meat on here. And while we're putting meat on here, I'm gonna go chop down some more trees for more firewood. All right, guys, I just heard some natives um, off in the distance, so that's making me uh, more than a little nervous. More than a little nervous. So, oh boy. All right, well I need these uh, planks, I think, for this. Right? Those are planks, man. That is expensive. It's actually, um, that's actually, uh, pretty freaking expensive, honestly. Um, because of the planks. Planks are, planks are, exp uh, expensive and not easy to produce. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. All right, somebody say I could press Y to organize this or something, or... No, I guess not. Um, I'll have to look that up. Someone said Y or something, and you could, like, organize your inventory. I don't know. I could have swore it was Y. Come on. Seriously? Uh, I'm always playing Tetris in this game. <laughs> if I wanted to play Tetris, I'd play Tetris. All right. Anyway, because of the um the the I keep wanting to call them cannibals because of the uh um the natives, I do have to worry. Um, I'm thinking I'm gonna look for rocks and we, oh boy, we need to get this thing going. Hold on one second. Let's put some uh, wood on here. I think we're gonna let this burn out and get the charcoal from it. Um, after we've cooked all our food. Uh, but as far as the natives go, I need to make a weapon. And um, I think I'm going to make a stone spear and probably a three-pronged... Like, not three-pronged, but it's like a three-bladed axe. Could be pretty cool. Um, so we're going to have to kind of see about that. I could have swore I should have had another... I should have had another um, plank back at, uh, back at base. I don't know why I didn't. But I'm going to take back some of these sticks. These sticks are going to be useful for things. Um, I don't know what, but I do know for things... For thangs. But not really what I need right now, but it's pretty good. Yeah, I broke up three of those um thick logs. I don't know where that other oh uh, I don't know where that other plank went. I should have another plank over here. Oh well, it is what it is. Let's go ahead and get some more. Freaking oh, hold on. Let's go ahead and get some food first. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Uh drag this down here, drag this down here. Eat. Beautiful. Okay. All right. Man, it's getting dark. All right, I'm going to do the rest of this uh, gathering of resources in the dark because uh, off camera because I don't like making dark videos. The hell with that. <laughs> Not on my watch. All right, guys, it's the next morning, and um, I went ahead and finished a small plant box. Look at this thing, huh? Huh? Not bad. Not bad. I got to find out where to get fertilizer. I know there's animal droppings out there, but I, I don't know if they just, like, randomly appear on the ground or whatnot. I don't, I don't you know, we're just going to have to kind of find that out as we go. Um, but there's other things you can use. You can also use other things. For, uh, shut up, man. I'm trying to talk. You can also use other things as fertilizer. Like, I think, like, rotten food and stuff. So, you know, we'll look into that as well. Um, all right. So, right here, you can see I made, I made three of these stone blades. And right now, I'm going to replace my axe. Uh, we don't need the stone blades for the axe, but I just wanted you to know that I have three stone blades because we're going to make my first melee weapon. Now, I don't know if spears are better. I know they have more range, but I don't know. I kind of feel like some of the melee weapons kind of are better than the spear. Uh, and I'm going to make my favorite melee weapon that I can craft right now. And you know, I'll show you that in a second. Also, there's supposed to be a machete in this camp somewhere. I haven't had time to look for it, but I probably should. I don't know if we're going to have time today, though, man, because we got we got a carbohydrate issue coming upon us. So, I think we're going to have to go out there looking for more carbohydrates. Okay, there we go. All right. So, now that we've got that taken care of, we're going to come on in here, and we are going to put three of these in the middle. Craft, craft, craft. And then we are going to go ahead and put a stick in there. We're going to make a blade axe. And this thing's going to have three blades on it. And I don't know. It seems pretty good to me. So, we'll just kind of see how that goes. we got to find more stone now, though. Because I can't gut anything because I don't have any stone. But, you know, it is what it is. 
All right, well, let's, um, oh yeah, okay, so here's another thing. All right, I wanna plant something here. Now, what do I wanna plant? Well, the only thing I have on me that I can plant is Mullinaria, okay? Do I really need to plant Mullinaria? Well, bandages are kind of important, so sure, why not? So what I did was I right-clicked on Mullinaria and I picked Harvest. That gave me a Mullinaria flower. Can't, can't plant Mullinaria flowers. So I'm gonna plant the Mullinaria flower dried. After a while, this will dry and then you can plant it. So that's what I'm gonna do. Cool. Cool. So I heard you can you can plant bamboo. I think that might be the next thing we, we want to kind of mess with. Um, I don't think I'm going to mess with mud today. I think I'm just going to do nothing but cultivation because I'm pretty freaking excited about it because it's like really, really new to me. Uh, you know, let's go ahead. Wait, what is that? Uh, regular stone. And I think, oh, no, we need two, right? All right, let's go ahead and uh, harvest this. I want to save the big stones because I need them to make like fire rings later on, but... You know, hopefully they'll just respawn. I need that crafted thing just in case I got to, uh, you know, gut something. All right, I'm going to put this right here. I'm going to put this as... I'm going to put my weapons as number one and two. There you go. It's intimidating. I'll say that. Oh, look at that. We got a, um, got a little mushroom over here. We'll grab that since we are going to have to worry about carbohydrates. Oh, God. You know, I think we have to do carbohydrates right now. I think I see a uh, bulb tree. Oh, another mushroom. Sweet. And that is a bulb tree. Hell yeah, it is. Careful over here. I've been attacked by jaguars in this in this area in the past. Although it usually only happens at night. Now, can we um can we farm that? Yes, we can. Do we want to farm that? You know, I might farm it instead of eating it. You know, I think I can get away with that since I got a couple of um a couple of these mushrooms. Yeah, you can't you can't um farm the mushrooms apparently. So there's that. Okay. All right. So, you know what? Let's go get some bamboo. And I'm going to see it. Because I heard you can grow bamboo. I don't know how true that is. But I wouldn't even know where to begin with that. So, we're going to kind of come over here and grab some bamboo. And I guess we'll just grab these little bamboo sticks and see if we can do something with those. All right. So, there they go. All right. So, that's a long bamboo stick. Harvest. That's going to give me little sticks. All right. I know that. That's going to give me these um these little ones right here. Right, the regular bamboo sticks. So craft, take, destroy. Okay, so we can't turn those into seeds. But what I'm thinking is you might be able to take the bamboo itself and just plop it right into a, um, you know, right, in, right into a plot. Yeah, so that's going to, yeah, we can craft, pick up, destroy. Yeah, all right. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take one of these back because I think if I had to guess on which one I would plant, I would imagine it would be these big bamboo uh, pieces. So we're going to kind of see what's going on right there. And the watch is telling me that um, something's wrong with me. And I just happen to know that it is going to be, um, it is going to, it is going to be my uh, carbohydrates. Uh, but I do have some stuff on me. So let's take a look. Uh, I do have a candy bar. All right. Very nice. And that takes care of me for the time being. Eh, not that much. So let's see if we have anything else over here that'll give us some carbohydrates. I don't think that can will give me... If I had to guess at that can, I would guess it would give me... Um, it would give me protein. But, more candy bars. More candy bars. And potato... I'm guessing these are potato chips. There we go. Alright, so now we're looking a lot better. That's great. So the reason I'm eating that those foods now is because food is not going to be a problem once I get a, an item that I might get next video. I might not. I'm not really sure. But it's called the bamboo dryer. And once I get the bamboo dryer, food is going to be so much easier to handle. Also, I have ways to deal with um, hydration as well um, in the near future. All right. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to save the game and I'm going to go ahead and make another uh, large plant bed. And let's see. Plant bed? Is that what they're called? I don't know. I'm going to make another large one. And then we're going to... Um, we're going to go ahead and try and plant some bamboo. It's rainy again. I love me some rain. Small planting box. Hold Q to plow. All right. If you plow it, from what I understand, you uh, can take the seeds out or take whatever plant is in there, but you don't get the seeds back. So if you plow that, it basically wipes it clean and you don't get anything back. So just be aware of that. All right. So let's see. Oh, by the way, I got a heart of palm while I was out and you cannot turn it into seeds. Um, as far as I can tell, you can't plant it. Uh, yeah, you know what? I'm going to, nah, let's not, let's not do that just yet. Um, you can turn the unknown fruit into seeds, I'm assuming, because it says harvest, but I got to be honest with you. I, I don't think the fruit, like six carbohydrates, like, 
Are you going to be able to plant like, well, you're going to get three fruit per, but that's still only three times, uh, three times six at 18. That's not really a lot of carbohydrates. I don't think that that's a, probably a great way to use my, um, my plant beds. Um, is that what they're called? I want to call them, I want to call them the proper thing. Let's take a look really quick. Um, planting box, planting box. This is a very strange name. I've never heard any other game call it that. That's going to take a little bit of time for me to get used to. All right. Well, where is my bamboo? Did I bring any bamboo back? I did. So, hmm, it looks like I can plant it. I just got to figure out how. Oh, maybe not. I thought you could plant bamboo, or maybe not this kind of bamboo. All right, I just looked it up, and you can actually grow bamboo, but you can't grow the big bamboo log plants, as far as I can tell from what I read. Um, it has to be, like, the smaller ones, which... It's, it's useful, but I don't know how useful. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to harvest the unknown bulb. And you need a big plant bed for this. So this is going to be my carbohydrate thing. Between this and the between this and the bananas, I should be good to go with carbohydrates. Um, which makes this just freaking awesome. So let's see where that went. All right, there we go. Unknown root. Oh, you get two of them? Oh, that's interesting. I'm kind of surprised you get two of them, to be honest. Expand. Yeah, so you can't do nothing with it. So I'll just put that up there for now. Oh man, we're gonna have a freaking great time with this. No joke. Let's go ahead and clear our inventory a little bit. Eh. All right, that's good enough. By the way, people keep telling me to uh, make bone soup, and yeah, that's true. You can make bone soup, and it's a really excellent source of fats. So that will be awesome. We'll definitely do that at some point. Eh, I'll drop that on the ground, but I'll hold the other. I'll hold the other stuff for now. All right, cool. I can't wait for those bananas to grow. That is so sweet. So sweet. Now, what else do I want to grow? I don't know. I don't know. You know, I think I'm going to hold off for now and just kind of see where things go. Um, what do we want to do next? We go exploring? We go mess with the natives? I think that'll be pretty fun. Or we could work on mud. You know what? Forget the natives. Let's work on the mud. I think that's going to be a, a better use of our time. All right. So what we, need to, what we need to do now is we need to get some mud thingy-mabobs down, some mud creator things i don't even know what they're called let's find out um this storage box is freaking awesome mud mixer that's what we want i want to get two of these down so you know what i think we're gonna do i think we're gonna take this tree out if we can actually can you yeah we can now we just cut down all the leaves but that tree's still there so what's up with that by the way these are oh these are palm leaves okay what's up with that what are we gonna do about that well it's very simple um, all you gotta do is log out of the game, or not, I don't even think you have to log out of the game, just log out of the world, and then just come back in, and that stuff will be gone. And this is where I'm keeping all my stuff, by the way. All my junk, like, you know, these, uh, leaves and stuff. I should probably make some stick holders and everything, too. That would probably be for the best. Anyway, let me log out and log back in, just to show you that stump will be gone. So I just saved the game, alright? I left the game, and then came back. I didn't even leave the game completely. I just like left the uh I just left the world. Didn't even shut down the game. And that uh plant is gone. So that's great. Now the only thing we can't get rid of, as far as I'm aware of, is these trees right here. We just gotta kinda build around them, but that's alright. It's not the end of the world. We'll do what we can. Alright, so we clearing out a little area here. Now I don't know if it's worth making more than one of these mud mixers. Um I guess it probably is, but I don't know how much it is, you know? It takes eight logs, and that is hella expensive. So I'm not going to make more than one right away, and maybe I'll make more than one later on. Um, because, yeah, I mean, seriously. Like, damn, that's expensive. I don't like where that where that went out. So let's try that again. Okay, so that's looking pretty good right there. Right? Right? All right, that's better. Yeah, I mean, eight freaking logs. And one thing that is, is rough around me is logs. I don't have... Like, there's not a lot, there's not a ton of logs in my area. There's really not. There's a lot of bamboo. Um, but I'm going to have to go pretty far for logs at some point. Going far for logs is not good. Uh, considering you can only carry three of them. So, yeah. Um, but the cool thing is my base will be made out of... Will be made out of... Um, man, my guy's all tired and shit. Uh, my base will be made out of bamboo, which is going to make it easier. Uh, I just wish we could, I wish we could, um, farm the big bamboo, you know, like, we can only farm the little ones, which kind of sucks. Although, if, if they're only going to let you farm one bamboo, the, the, the small bamboo, 
or the lo- basically you, you can grow the bamboo and then you can get the long bamboo poles. There's three types of wood and bamboo in the game. Um, well, there's there's four types of wood. There's small sticks, big sticks, long sticks, and thick logs. Okay, for bamboo, there's small sticks, long sticks, and big logs. All right, the big logs I'm gonna need for foundations, but honestly, I'm gonna need more of the long sticks than anything. So I guess that's fine. I, what else can I do with small sticks for the bamboo? I don't know. I, I haven't, you know, I haven't been on this game in a while. So <laughs> I love the fact that it's still raining. We need. We're gonna have to get our water our water situation. Um, you know, under control by the time dry season comes along. I don't know when that is. Uh, let's take a look. It's December. When does your dry season start? I don't know. But we're going to have to get that under control, uh, the, the, the water situation under control before dry season, or we're going to be in a world of hurt. So um, I don't know what I can do about that. Well, I know what I can do about it. I can make a... Um, there's this thing, uh, I'm sur honestly, I'm surprised I don't have it yet. It's a mud item. It's like a, um, here, let's see if we have it. Uh, we have the storage box, the walls, the roofs, the doorways, firesides, shelter walls. No, I think it's in here. And it's like, it's like a mud, it's not a mud shower, it's like a mud, uh, still. And I'm kind of surprised I don't have it. I, I didn't think it was a recipe for me to find, but I'm gonna have to look into that, because that's going to be, um... Really, it's going to be awesome if, if I can get that. If I can't, well, you know, we can figure out other things, but I'm just going to make it more difficult. All right, guys, I got parasites from eating while it was dirty, uh, but I got rid of them by picking these mushrooms right here. These, like, orange mushrooms. Negative one parasites. I'm going to let these mushrooms go bad, probably. I guess, maybe. I don't know. I, I, was, I was thinking about letting them go bad to use them as fertilizer, just for the lulls, but I don't know. Uh, why don't we go ahead and wash ourselves off while we're down here. Uh, wash yourself, please. There you go. Alright. I am cooking up some mushroom soup at the moment. And then I will cook up some heart of the palm soup. And I'll probably mess around a little bit of mud. Although it is getting dark. So once it gets dark, I am going to call the video. Uh, you know, because we're getting to the end anyway. Um, I was kind of hoping this stuff would grow uh, before the end of the video. But that's okay. And it's perfectly fine. Alright, let's take a look at our stats. Yeah, we can definitely use some of this. All right, and then we're going to do is we're going to fill this up, fill this up, and go ahead and make the heart of the palm. If you drink a soup while you're not thirsty, you can, like, drink the soup twice. So I should probably try and do that. Um, should I make some mushroom soup? Does it still give five carbohydrates if I do? Eh, let's give it a shot. Why not? What have we got to lose? All right. So, all right, let's go ahead and drink... Okay, and is that because I filled myself up? I only took 20. There should be 30 in there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to fill up my bidone. There we go. Not fill it up, but get a bunch more in there. All right, so um, we are just about done with the mud mixer. There we go. And now we just need to get some mud. So what we'll do is we will go down to the river mud. Oh, yeah, we got to let that fire burn out repeatedly, don't we? I think we need ash for the mud mixer. If memory serves me correct. Nope, oh, good. More mushrooms. Very good. I'm just gonna let that fire burn out. The hell with it. Like I said, I think we're gonna need ash. Uh, if we if we don't need ash for the mud mixer, then I think we need it for for something. I don't remember what we need ash for. I just know we need it. I I know we need it. Maybe for the uh. Oh, you know what we need ash for, I think? Maybe the, 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 the charcoal furnace thingy? I don't know. Maybe. So there we go. And we just need to get one more thing of mud. And then we can mix it up. And we'll have, I think, five pieces to build with. It's going to take a while. No doubt. But, you know, we'll get there. I don't know what I want to do next episode. I don't know if I want to... If I want to go out and... um, Shut up, timer. I don't know if I want to go out and get the, uh, the bamboo dryer. Or if I want to start building. I'm probably going to get the bamboo dryer. Because it's important. It's going to really help with food. And that will open me up to really get some building done. The only thing I don't like about this mud thing is it's so far away. Um, so far away from the water. It sucks. But I don't, I don't know of any other way to do it. So just kind of kind of live with it. There we go. And then... Oh, there you do need it for the mud. Okay. So you need the campfire ash for the mud. Wow. Okay. I don't think we're going to be doing a lot of building anytime soon, man. This is going to take a while. This is going to take a while, but we'll get there. We will get there. Oh, of course, it stopped raining. 
I'm gonna let it rain for that. Basically, what'll happen is um, you need to put water in there, and then you can mix it up, and then you'll get six, five or six pieces of mud um, to build with. I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna waste water on that though. I'll just wait for it to rain. It'll be raining soon enough. So. Yeah, that'll be great. Anyway, guys, if you didn't enjoy the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.